What's going on YouTube? Crypto Matrix here coming at you with another cryptocurrency stream and guys the Bitcoin price shot all the way up to $12,000 just like I predicted yesterday. It put in that bull flag and pumped straight up guys. There is lots to go over. Guys if that sounds good to you be sure to subscribe and like and I'm going to dive right into the price action. Alright guys so check it out. Right out of this descending wedge here we had a pump up. Right here I was talking about it's going to be a bull flag painted. Bam! Bull flag painted and $12,000 target hit. So this is some very bullish news, guys. This means, you know, some higher times are right around the corner. If we can actually break through $12,000 and remain stable, that is a very bullish sign, guys. And if we can just continue this trend, there's not much resistance above us. For instance, it's all the way up at like $13,000, $15,000. We could punch right up to like $12,600 by the end of the week if nothing stops us, guys. This is very exciting, bullish times for Bitcoin. Are the altcoins getting slammed right now? And guys, yes, they are. Some of them are down 50, 60, 70, 80%. Are these good times to be buying alts right now? There are several that I've been talking about for a long time, guys, and I think they're just about to hit optimal buy times. A few of them like Orchid or Bat, definitely some solid buys right now, guys, and I'm going to go into that in a minute. But guys, what's actually going to push this up? So pretty much if we can get a little bit of another consolidation like a tightening of the Bollinger Bands here we will get another leg up push to the side and a break up for sure and as you can see the EMA 20 is above the EMA 55 just pushing straight up that's a very good sign unless we get some kind of big drop off like we had back on the 16th we could just see this punch straight up to like 12,006 guys it's really exciting news and some good times for Bitcoin ending the year out and there's a few other coins I wanted to go over, guys. I wanted to keep it real short and sweet, guys. I just wanted to go over the facts today, just real be brief. OXT is about to hit optimal buy times. Okay, guys, I have this line down here that I'm going to be buying at right here, whether it hits here, 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 here. I'm going to be looking to buy, and I bet you any money there's going to be another big pump like this. Okay, guys? So just like what just recently happened, I'm willing to get in on that. Guys, I think it's worth the risk. I think you should be willing, too. And the reason I think it'll pump is because after it dumps down, you know, 20, 40 percent, there is a pump. It's happened pretty religiously. So from the top, 48 percent pump right out of it. From there, 48 percent pump right out of it. From top to bottom, we're at 52 percent, so we're a little over right now. I think, it, you know, we're overdue for a big mat, a big leg up. Okay, guys, so just be prepared for that. That's what I think is going on in OXT. And I can't stress enough, you know, it's you put $10,000 down, you get a, you know, a big 50-60% up, guys. That feels huge. That feels huge when you make that gain. And I can't stress it enough that it's worth the risk, guys. OXT is just in its infancy stage. They've only been on some major exchanges now for not even a year yet. And with so much potential all the way up at 0.84 at its high, you know, we're in very good buy times right now as you can see guys we're basically at the 52 week range low we're very close to it so basically the low is you know right down here so that's not very far guys so we're you know we're very close to all-time lows and I think we're breaking away from this pattern that's going down right there you see that we're kind of trending away from it right now so I think that's a good sign I think this will be the low and hopefully we'll get a big bounce out I'm gonna be putting my money down guys let me know if you do in the comments and guys, I wanted to go over Electronium. We're still following that trend that I have written, and it's going to be for a while. We're going to be bouncing around in this trend for a while. Hopefully, we get a breakout to the right. That would be a really good sign, and then we get a pump up to the green box. But as of now, we're just going to be moving right, bouncing between support and resistance, guys. And it's as simple as that. When the coin you know, gets a little bit more action going, a little bit more just stuff going in general, not just not the coin's project, but I mean just cryptocurrency. Like When more people are buying it and stuff, we're going to see... These prices are going to be left behind. And I can't stress enough, guys. Even in the 52-week range, we're still pretty much in the low from all the way up at a cent. You know, guys, this is you know a 50% drop. I think these are good times still to buy Electronium. Even if you sit in the red a little bit, say like it follows the channel down, you buy here. That's okay. You'll get a pump right out of it. If you look at the recent trends here, guys, you know, we've been kind of just consolidating to the right. And it looks very volatile looking at it. But in general, you know, I think that there's a lot of room to the upside with Electronium. And just because of how solid the project is, the Anytask program's really crushing it. And the app is really easy to use, guys. So if you combine all those factors, that's how I make my decisions, other than just graph analysis and news. You know, you just gotta understand. And uh, understanding is key to just about anything. So guys, I wanted to go over BAT really quick. 
down at 20 cents, guys. Are these optimal times? We talked about here on the 22nd being a really good time to buy, or the 21st, excuse me. Again on the 7th, again on the 16th, and again on the 20th. How many times are we going to bounce off this bottom before we get a good pump out of it? That's the question, guys. And I think it's very worth it to get in on bat right now. I think if it were, if it was to go any lower, I think 0.16 would be the absolute bottom. And just to be honest, guys, it's very hard to actually pick the bottoms out. I mean, you can only draw your supports. You can only draw your... I don't have anything drawn on this graph right now. But in general, I remember because I was in on this at 11 cents to 16 from 16 to 21. And I remember that's where I got in at support levels. So for instance, there's definitely a support right down here at 20 cents. Hopefully we can get a good bounce off of it and just see something massive. For instance, we saw it go from 27 all the way up to 43, guys. So that is a massive pump. Very massive, guys. I think it's very worth it to be in on BAT, guys. And if you don't know much about BAT, they're the ones with the Brave browser. And that just has a lot of good things coming for its future. And BAT is going to be, you know, way over a dollar before you know it, guys. So I think it's very worth it to be in on BAT right now. And guys, the Bitcoin price nears its final hurdle at 12K before a bull market euphoria. And guys, I believe this. The Bitcoin price nearing 12,000 once again, which may be the signal for a start of a massive new bull cycle. And guys, let's be real here. We've been in a bull cycle since March. This is no surprise to me. I've been bullish the whole way through, guys. I think you guys should be too. And if you're not, you're being silly. But let's be real here. Everyone's looking for those dips. Scoop up the dips as best you can. So that way you're making good gains on the profits. I think we're going to be moving up to at least late 2021. So these are very easy times to make money. I can't stress enough. And uh, the price of Bitcoin had to hold crucial support levels between 11,100 and 11,300 before it could actually pump up to these levels. And after it did, the support was the test and the price of Bitcoin continued to surge upward on October 20th, reaching crucial resistance area between 11,900 and 12,200. The upper move came along with the weakness in the dollar as the US dollar currency index dropped substantially a correlation that's been effective throughout 2020 already. However, the cryptocurrencies haven't been following Bitcoin's footsteps as altcoins are selling off heavily. Is this attention shifting back to Bitcoin, guys? And I gotta just be honest here, Bitcoin's never lost its attention. It's always been pumping. I've been bullish on Bitcoin this whole time. But that being said, a lot of the altcoins, I've been talking about this for weeks, 50, 60, 70, 80% drops, guys. This is the time to buy the alts too. If they drop much more, guys, that's okay. I can't stress enough. They will pump out of there and you will be happy. Even to say you get a 15, 20% loss waiting for that pump, that is just regular price action, guys. I've, I've done it before. It, it's okay. So the weekly level at 12,000 is crucial level to break. And as you can see here, guys, we've had it several times back here. 2018 here in 2019 and now again 2020 this is a very crucial point to actually break through guys can we actually pump through here and if we do what resistances do we have you know right there right there and then that's the twenty thousand dollar top above that guys so there's not much holding it down hopefully we can push through this to the upside as soon as possible guys and as i said the altcoins are getting crushed by recent bitcoin moves whether BTC goes up or down, it doesn't matter. Altcoins are dropping like stones, guys. So this could be the opportune time to buy some altcoins and make some good gains. And guys, like I said, I wanted to keep it really short and sweet. I'm actually uh, training for a new job right now, so I'm pretty busy with that, and I'm trying to get some trades in as best I can. Um, so thank you again so much, guys, for all your support. I got several subs since my last video. That's just awesome, guys. Keep the support rolling. Keep this page rolling, guys. I plan to keep you know uploading videos ongoing you know so just keep showing support guys i'll keep putting the calls out there for you guys to see and i hope you guys are making good money right along with me and if you're not just pay attention to the supports that i put down and i will tell you almost exactly where to buy in and if, and i'll even share where i'm buying in personally so you can literally buy in exactly where i am guys and that's honestly the truth so whatever whatever you guys can put down at those times i promise you you know it's going to be good good turnaround for you guys it, it has been for me time and time and time again I have a very high win rate up in the 90s so very good very good things to come and cryptocurrency I can't stress enough guys these are bullish times and with cryptocurrency still in its infancy stage now is the time to get in on cryptocurrency if you haven't already guys and guys don't forget I am doing a giveaway for my ledger nano s one of my first 500 subscribers are into win this ledger nano s and all you have to do is subscribe to be part of that and guys, that's all I have time for today. Thank you so much for all your support. I am Crypto Matrix. I will catch you guys later.